Let's unbox Dacboard's Touch 22. As you open the box, you'll first find a pamphlet with easy to follow instructions for setting up your touchscreen. This includes how to adjust the mounting bracket if you want to mount your wall display in landscape or portrait view. This is your AC power cable. It's five feet long and works for US plug outlets. So for those in other countries using different outlets, you will need an adapter. Here we have directions and drywall sheetrock mounting anchor and screw if you're interested in mounting your display up on a wall. And you get a little cloth for wiping your screen to remove smudges as needed. Here's a better look at the mounting bracket I mentioned earlier. And this is your wall display. It's a 1920 by 1080 HD screen with a high gloss finish. On the back, you'll find all of your monitor buttons and the USB cable needed to power the touch function is already plugged in place. Instead of mounting on a wall, I'm going to set up this display on a tabletop stand. This is something you can get separately for a pretty low price on Dacboard's shop page. To do this, begin by removing the wall mount plate. Then place the stand on the back, lining up the screw ports. Then put the four screws back into place. With the tabletop stand, you can easily rotate between landscape and portrait views for whatever layout you use for your Dacboard screen. Don't forget to remove the screen cover, and note that this one comes with two. Now let's get our cables together and plugged in to begin connection setup. After a few minutes of loading, it will reveal the network configuration screen. Bypass the QR codes by tapping the bottom of the screen where it says touchscreen on device setup. On the network settings configuration page, enter your Wi-Fi credentials, adjust time zone, orientation, and resolution, then hit save. This will give you your link code needed to connect your device to your Dacboard account. Log in at dacboard.com and in your devices section, click the add button. Give your device a name, add your link code, then select your screen to assign to it, click save and enjoy.